I'm Todd Grisham. Alongside me, English fighting legend Johnny Nelson. I feel like a fraud. How have I got these ringside seats? And now it's time for the tale of the tape. Tyson Fury. He stands an imposing six foot nine inches tall with a reach of 85 inches. And he'll face the bronze bomber, six foot seven inches tall with that massive 83 inch reach. What a weight difference. These two fighters are going to be in deep water. One has a size, has a weight behind it. The other is small, shorter, much, much lighter. Gotta be fast, gotta be sharp. Otherwise, you're out of there. The Gypsy King himself, Tyson Fury, this multi-time heavyweight champion of the world fighting out of Manchester, England. He'll beat you down and then sing to you afterwards. The Bronze Bomber, one of the hardest punchers in heavyweight history. His knockout percentage is off the chart. I'm so excited for this fight. There is no nonsense here. Well, we're all set. Let's go into the ring for the classy Jimmy Lennon Jr. This bout is scheduled for eight rounds of boxing. In the red corner from Manchester, England, and standing at six feet nine inches, here is a sensational heavyweight champion of the world, the Gypsy King, Tyson Fury. Fighting out of the blue corner, an Olympic bronze medalist from Tuscaloosa, Alabama, a hard-hitting sensational knockout artist, and a WBC heavyweight champion of the world, the bronze bomber, Deontay Wilder. What a pleasure it is to be here in this environment. What a venue for this showdown. This place is like a coliseum. When it's packed out, the fans are there. You can hear the punches. You can smell the sweat. The heat is second to none. Under the bright lights here for this one, really good matchup, and we're hoping for a really good fight. And there's the bell to start the round. Nice idea with the jab, but does not land. <laughs> You'd like to see more jabs. <laughs> so much for boxing. This is a fist fight. Well, we all know, when Wilder fights Fury, someone is getting knocked down, and probably both guys. Oh my gosh, come on! This is that fight! No matter what you think of Tyson Fury, he has got in there with the biggest, most powerful, most dangerous fighter, puncher in the world, in down to Wilder. This guy can knock you out from two inches. He's got it, but Tyson Fury was smart. A, a, a complete warmonger got in his head well before they stepped in the ring. This is fight number four. Every fight is getting more exciting than the other. And every time Tyson Fury has had his number, Deontay Wilder is an angry, powerful, dangerous fighter. He always will be. But the only one that's got his number, Tyson Fury. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. Looking to land the hook. Nice counter shot. Swing and a miss with that. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. Let's talk about Fury in that last round. And a round that seemed like eternity for them finally comes to a close. The bell, sometimes it couldn't be the sweetest sound. Good work. That's it. Man. Green, green. Just get the back there. Good work. Just the same again. Don't change too much yet. Keep doing what you're doing. Good enough. You're still running your power shots. Good work. Don't forget the jab. And don't get carried. Fight. Don't give him no free shots. Keep smart. The jab's working nice. Those one, two, straight down the middle. You can't miss. Great. Stay focused. Focus. Don't let back into the fight. 
quickly. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. So the fight will continue. How do they turn things around? This is one of those situations. You've just been hurt. You've got to get out there again. Be smart. Be sharp. Don't be a fool. Don't get suckered in. Make him fight your fight. Hold him. Tie him up. Just until your head clears again and your legs come back again. Because if you don't, he's going to pop you off. <laughs> A lot of trash talk between these two fighters. Now it's time to put up or shut up. It's so hot, so heated. There's a roof on me. You don't understand. When you're working, when the noise is there, the pressure's on, you're thirsty, you're sweating, and you're getting on the, you're on the wrong side of a beating. This can be hellfire on earth. Both men step back for just a moment. Both fighters landing in these exchanges. Judge is going to have a tough job. And that left hook doesn't find its target. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill. Tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what, I'm just that notch above you. And so I've got to respect both of them more than happy. Beautiful counter punch. This counterfighter believes in me. anything you can do, I can do better. They'll let you throw a punch first, and they'll answer you, and usually hit you harder. If you're fighting a counter puncher, you've got to dummy a shot. Make them react from that, then react them. I know it's hard to think that way, but counter punchers, they're watching you, watching you every move, that every touch. Despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. Let's talk about Fury in that last round. Well, he is in big trouble here. He may have been saved by the bell. Wow. You know, I've been in fights like that. When you think you come up, though, ring away. You walk back to the corner like you've just seen the sun. Stay focused, don't let him back into the fight. Don't give him no free shot. Get carried away. Think about the defense on him, and think about what... Smart, you weren't loading up, but you still ran in your power shots. Don't forget the jab. Yet, keep doing what you're doing, the gaps will appear. You're getting your top of Just the same again. Time winding. Everybody shots him. They ring the bell, and here we go. After that last round, something has got to change. They've got one minute to recover. Now they've got to bluff it. They've got to bluff it. They've got to come up now and style it out. Get on the back foot. Jab. Rest on the jab. Be smart and pop until your legs come back. Then, put the pressure on. That uppercut does not score. Missing with the left hook. Oh, and Tyson Fury just got rocked. This could be it. Tyson Fury, one of the great heavyweight champions. Looks like trouble. Tyson Fury just got And down goes Fury. And as we see it again in slow motion, there's no doubt. That body punch right there buckled him. Shot from the gods, they say. A shot from the gods. Looks like he's leading halfway through this round. No one would have blamed him if he didn't get up, but here we go again, and this could get ugly. What resilience to be down and to be back up again, to get your foot back into fight again, to show your fitness and determination, maximum respect. That is a show of character. When you're put down, your rugal's hurt, your chin's hurt, your body's hurting, and you've got to get up, suck it up, and think, right, I'm back in the game again. It's so, so hard for a fighter. He threw a punch and just got countered. It doesn't always pay to be first. 
It pays to be last. Final 10 seconds here, unless something major happens. I think we all know he won that one. Let's talk about Fury in that last round. That'll be a 10-8 round for sure with the knockdown. You've been put down, you've got to think right, survive, and then give it back the next round. Nice round. Good round. I like that. Okay. And there's the bell to start the round. Let's see how he bounces back here after getting dropped in the last round. What a knockdown. One minute, you need one hour to get over a shot like that. And now it's down to conditioning. Now it's down to motivation. Preparation is how you are going to do it. This is the type of fighter that would say, I don't even want rounds. Let's just fight until one of us can't stand up anymore. Oh, this is a stuck around here for These kind of fighters, they want to get hit in the face because it cheats them on. They want to stand there and fight in the trenches. Off the charts action from both of these fighters. Nice counter. Nice counter shot. A very competitive round here so far. A very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other because no one dare do anything out of turn. They call it the glory division. There's nothing quite like a heavyweight fight. It doesn't take much to win it. Well done with that counter shot. And Tyson Fury just got clipped. The big fella might be in big trouble. Didn't wait long. Tyson Fury just got rocked. Do you believe this? This round's still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. Tyson Fury in serious trouble. I don't see how he's going to get out of this. Let's talk about Fury in that last round. And a round that seemed like an eternity for them finally comes to a close. Every second, every minute of this fight is important. Every second, every minute of this round is important. You cannot afford to lose. They ring the bell, and here we go. Not the start that they wanted, but let's see what they can do in this round. That was a tough last round. Now you've got to make sure he doesn't put it on him. That's what he's going to try and do. So tie him up, hold him, lean on him. Don't get drawn into a fight. Not yet, not until your senses have come back. That counter shot lands. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. Every time they drop their guard, they get caught. They both want to knock out, you can tell. You can't make a mistake at the heavyweight level and not expect to be punished for it. Only catching air with that hook. This has been a very competitive round between these two. We both know who the bigger power puncher is. There's a significant power difference. How would you handle that? That power, that power might be the do or die. That power might be the, the, the equalizer. Is he going to punch himself out, though? Say no moss. Just miss with that hook. Those counter punches have to hurt. A very competitive round with 10 seconds left. Beautiful counter shot. Let's talk about Fury in that last round. He is down big time on the scores. Wow. It was... 
We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. Off their stools and ready to go. Let's hope this round is more competitive. Now he knows he's been hurt. He's gonna come up and put the pressure on. He's gonna throw the kitchen sink at you. And Tyson Fury just got clipped. The big fella might be in big trouble. He takes a step back, recalibrates himself, and goes right after him again. Got caught slipping on the job. What do you do? You step back, steady yourself, recompose yourself, then boom, back into it. But do not make those mistakes. This is the wrong place to fall asleep. Well, Johnny, it's still early on, but what do you think about what we're seeing so far? This could be really... Tyson Fury just got buzzed. His eyes don't look good. Body language is bad. He could go down. Down goes Fury. Thank goodness we've got instant replay. We get to see it again. That lights out right there. Pretty good start the first half of this round. Well, they're back on their feet right now, Johnny. Do they go toe for toe or do they play defense here? Some fighters, when this happens, this can be heartbreaking. Some fighters, it makes them angry. I'm going to get back into the mix again. I want to know what sort of character are we looking at here? He's up, but for how long? Look at him. Down goes Fury. Lincoln, you miss it. Good thing we can watch that all over again. A shot from the gods took him out. Let's talk about Fury in that last round. Is there any way back into this fight after the beating he has taken so far? And there's the bell to start the round. It's been a nightmare so far. What can they do to turn this around? Two knockdowns, and you're coming back from that. That's near on impossible, because your head must be all over the place. Your legs are feeling like jelly. What can they tell you in the corner? All they can do is wake you up. They can't even go into game plan. Nice counter shot. And he scores with the counter. Which one of these athletes is going to be the first to go down? Tyson Fury just got rocked. Do you believe this? How is this? Oh, and Tyson Fury just got rocked. This could be it. Tyson Fury, one of the great heavyweight champions. Down goes Fury. Wow, let's take another look at that. You're right, Tosh. What a shot. We're at the halfway point, and there's no doubt who's won this round so far. At some point, the corner has to stop the fight for this fighter because he's not going to lay down. Oh, he can see. Tyson Fury in serious trouble. I don't see how he's going to get out of this. He's landed everything he's got, but he can't get him out of there. What recovery skills they are. What a shot it was. Completely gone. I thought there's no way he's going to finish his round. Oh, look at that. Look at the movement. Look at the speed. Back on it. I can never have Tyson Fury just got buzzed. His head down goes Fury. And look at that body shot. They couldn't have thrown it any better. I've got to see that again.
You heard that right, ladies and gentlemen. A knockout victory and one of the biggest surprises of the year. A knockout victory? That's not a knockout victory. That is somebody saying, I'm here. I've arrived. Try that again. It will happen all over again.